One day after people. At a height of 510 miles, weather satellites soar over the North and South Poles, orbiting the Earth 14 times a day. Once, six billion people depended on the data they provided on sea level, rainfall, and humidity. Now, although their solar panels will continue to power them for decades, the satellites send their data to ground stations that are empty. There is no one in Moscow to be warned of a sudden cold front. No one to be told if this is one of the 25 days a year when rain will fall in Dubai. And no one will be warned if another hurricane threatens the levees of New Orleans. Fifty years after people. From 200 to 22,000 miles above the Earth's oceans, there is carnage. In the time of humans, almost 3,000 active satellites monitored the stars, the weather, and life below. In February 2009, a defunct Russian satellite crashed into a US satellite in a 600-piece pileup. Without humans to control the crowded spaceways, accidents have multiplied. Fragments strike at 15,000 miles an hour. The collisions send shards smashing into other satellites, sending some down in flames to be extinguished in the sea.